to NCAA football on the PlayStation 3. We are back to college football. Been looking forward to this moment for a very, very long time. So let's see what this game is all about again. Can't wait for the goosebumps on the intro of launching this game for the first time in so long. NCAA football 2012. EA Sports. It's in the game. Another season is upon us. Freshmen arrive wide-eyed with dreams of future glory, while seniors prepare for their last chance at immortality. There are only a handful of these opportunities in a man's life, a handful of chances to distinguish yourself from the rest. It's on these fields where history is made, where legends begin and heroes triumph. Traditions tell the story of what you represent, of those that forge the legacy you uphold. When you come charging out of the tunnel, 100,000 people will be watching your every move. How you respond to that pressure is what defines you. These are the moments that reveal your toughness, your determination, and your pride. The Roughnecks on the Sooner Schooner. Ralphie charging out of the gate. And Chief Osceola planting his spear. The time has come. Your time is now. Can you believe it? I finally got this to work seems like so sound and all Let's see if I can get through a whole game and not have a problem <clears throat> you know how long it's been since I've played anything like this my god How long has it been since the college football games been out? The um next thing I'm going to go.
I used to kick it back then? Take a while though. I know uh, Texas A&M is
I don't even remember if Big East anymore. Um, what? Cincinnati uh, Bearcats. American Athletic. There was There wasn't even that back then. Do this. <coughs> you know what? There's no big east, so that's what this is going to be right here.
this is this
one more. And it's Mary. So I gotta pick up Mary.
teams in the other conferences. So, Mac, Akron, Bowling Green, Ball State, Central Michigan. They're all right. Buffalo Bulls, yep. Kent State, Eastern Michigan. Miami, Ohio, yep. Northern Illinois, Ohio Bobcats, Toledo Rockets, Western Michigan. Temple is not there. <coughs> Team. I don't even have to. Oh my god. I forgot about that. I can just add them. Alright. Which one's the first? I for, mm, I'm stupid, dude. Let me quickly go back to the independence. Add them. I'm thinking I have to wait till I find the team and move them. I forgot I could just hit add. To make it much easier. Sorry for this. Long, 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 long. Is that is Liberty even in this game?
Mountain West. Uh, if I were to say New Mexico, like Fresno. See, this is an older game too. So I think. You know, I gotta get. I'm gonna eventually get. Four, I shouldn't even have done this. I'm gonna get 14 very, very soon. So I'm basically just wasting my time because I'm gonna have to redo it all on 14. Where is the sun though?
deputy's teams I don't even think are in here, dude. <coughs> Georgia State, Georgia Southern. Georgia Southern in here. Let's see what non-conference teams like to
GameStop for NCAA 14. That's more than a new PlayStation 4 game. That makes no sense. Named for the Commonwealth of Kentucky, this stadium underwent a major renovation in 1999. Wildcat football has been played here since 1973. Hi, everybody. I'm Brad Nessler, and helping me call this one is Kirk Herbstreet. And Aaron Andrews also joins us on the sidelines. Welcome to another game of NCAA football. We're brought to you by our friends at Coke Zero. Real Coke tastes and zero calories. Today's game is between the Texas A&M Aggies and the Wildcats of Kentucky. incredible season of action-packed football heading your way. For Texas A&M, the quarterback has got to keep tabs on this outstanding linebacker. I can't wait to see how he performs against a real top-notch tailback. It should be a test of his run-stopping ability. It's time for the coin toss, presented by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste and zero calories.
I miss the coin toss in the games, man. Madden took them completely out. Stupid. Texas Both teams have sent their special teams out of the field, and we're ready for the opening kickoff. And this season is officially underway. Davis from the two makes it to the 22 yard line took me a while to figure out the controls it's the analog stick for the kickoff <coughs> for Kentucky tell us what we should be on the lookout for from their offense this is definitely a pass first offense with lots of short safe routes they like to integrate a lot of different wide receivers, especially the backs and tight ends. Once they've got you going, they'll start using the run. It's somewhat conservative, but they can kill you with ball control. From their own 44-yard line, First down. They hand it off. He gets out to about the 45-yard line. That makes it second and eight. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 45. Throws it out right to the running back. Tackle made at the 46-yard line. Maybe got two feet on the play. The offense is trying to get the ball into the hands of the halfback here, and he did a pretty good job of getting a few yards, but the defense was just swarming to the ball right there. hit immediately. Great effort here by the wideout to secure the ball and pick up some extra yardage. It's first and ten. Ball on the 41. Off the right side. Doesn't get much. Good tackle. A two-yard run by the halfback. Well, this corner isn't the biggest guy on the field, but he made a nice tackle there. Let me switch the thing. Let's see. From the 39-yard line, second down. No! Oh. Slides down. Right. <laughs> Comes away with five yards on the scramble there. I forgot the old college game had the thing at the bottom, or the, had the score thing at the bottom. This one has a or at the top, and this one has it at the bottom, so. And here's another third oh. down. I hit triangle right as the thing disappeared, so. Oh, give me that. Throw in deep down the left sideline. Good time to bring the pressure. Yeah, I like it because even if you can't come up with a sack, just let the quarterback know you're coming and make him feel your presence. Sometimes that's just as effective as a sack. He gets it up, and it's long enough. And he got it. Kentucky is ready to kick it away. He's to the 10. 
And he just got drilled. Returns the kick. Kickoff return 25 yards. They'll start this drive at the 29-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. On the ground, and he won't get back to the line. And that play was snuffed out from the get-go. You're right. It's a delayed handoff to the tailback, and the defense wasn't fooled at all there. From their own 27-yard line, second down. And they push him out at the 35. That'll bring up third and four. It's third and four. Ball in the 35. The crowd is really letting him hear it. Fakes the handoff, and he's in trouble. Can't ask for much more than a three and out. Great job, defense. Fourth down. Fourth down. The punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. Smith is waiting for the snap. It's a high kick, and it holds up there. Signals for a fair catch. Fair catch made at the 27 yard line. This drive will start at the 27-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Slides down. He started to run and saw that the field ahead of him was wide open. That's a huge play. We've got a first and 10, ball in the 48. And he just gets rid of it. From the 48-yard line, it's second down. Ferguson gets the call. And he makes it out to about the 47-yard line. And the halfback's got nowhere to go. The safety came up from the secondary and made a nice, solid tackle. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 38. Kentucky is up by three. Complete. Good open field tackle. Makes the catch, but just not enough for the first. Yeah, they're going to come up a little bit short here. Nice job by the defense of preventing this completion from turning into a first down. Fourth down. Here comes the punter looking to boot this one away. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. Okay. <clears throat> They'll get the ball here at the 20-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Throws it and it's tipped away. Whoa. The safety comes up with a nice play. Nice job of the safety here, sitting back and playing center field, and then seeing the ball and coming up and simply batting the ball away. From their own 20 yard line, second down. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. going to lose yards here. They're stopped two yards behind the line. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. Third and 12. Uh, ball on the 18-yard line. Struggling. So this crowd is making their presence felt. Heaves a long one down the middle. He 
He's tackled at the 46. Well, the quarterback should have thrown that one out of bounds. There was just no room to get it past that safety. From the 46-yard line, first down. Ferguson gets the ball. He fights forward to about the 43. Ferguson gets three yards on the play. That'll make it second to seven. <coughs> From the 43 yard line, second down. And yeah, they get nice yardage on that run. Ferguson gains about five yards on the run. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. Yes. Looks to pass, and he's sacked. And they get a nice defensive play. Well, here's a play you don't see very often. That time they brought pressure from the corner position, and the line couldn't pick him up, and he was able to wrap the quarterback up for a sack. That's a good defensive call. Fourth down, they come out in a punt formation. Burke is back awaiting the punt. And he's got to be happy with that punt, Kirk. Yeah, Brad, that was nice. And now they're looking at a long way to go to even think about a score. They'll start this drive at the 12. First down, 10 yards to go. Jones on the pitch to the right. Jones picks up two yards with a carry. From their own 14-yard line, second down. And that one's incomplete. They line up at the 14. It's third down. No! He's brought down in the open field. So close, but they fall short of the first down. You gotta throw the ball a little deeper next time. Don't take any chances of coming up short. the offense that takes the field on fourth down. Kind of surprising here that they didn't elect to punt. I don't agree with this call. First down. And he hits him hard at the 24. Pound for pound, this is a very solid <laughs> offensive line. They know that if they do their job, they'll make enough room for short conversions. First and ten. Ball on their own 24. And they'll run him again. And they get nice yardage on that run. Jones gains around six yards on the run. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Hang on, everybody, because it looks like they came ready to play today. The score here in Lexington, Kentucky 3, Texas A&M nothing. Take it down to the backfield. 
I'm not even sure the ball carrier saw the corner coming for him. That happened so fast, he never had a chance to make a move. From their own 29-yard line, third down. He scrambles, throws it deep. Incomplete. It's knocked down by the defense. And the safety comes up with a nice play. These safeties are not only physical, but here is showing the athletic ability to get a hand on the ball. That is great coverage. Davis is back deep to return. Booming kick. Davis takes it to 25. He makes it out to maybe the 36-yard line. Made a few guys miss on his way to a quality return. <coughs> They'll start this drive at the 36-yard line. <coughs> Joseph off the left side. They go to the left for a nice game. Second and three coming up here. Ball on the 42. Ah! Looks for the tight end, but they can't hook up. Well, it's usually a good idea putting the ball in the hands of your halfback, but only when it stays there. Questionable call, but at least they're mixing up their offense a bit and trying to keep the defense on their toes. Could have been an easy interception. I was standing right there where the ball was going. Oh. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That's good awareness to know where the marker was and to make sure he got it there. If they had a bad spot, that could have been turned into a fourth down. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 47. He got a lot of jersey on that play. Not too much argument about this call. Holding on the offense. You've probably heard it said that there's holding on every play. It's just not called. I don't think it's really that prevalent. But you can get away with it sometimes. And other times you can't. First and long now after the penalty. Throws this one out to the left. Davis was the intended receiver on the play. That'll make it second and long. It's second and long. Ball on the 38. Catches it and hit for no gain. That screen play gets him a yard at the most. Third and long here, and they hope to convert another one and keep this drive going. The quarterback had a tough time with a blitz on that one. Well, with this guy, you can't let him stand back there and have too much time to throw the ball. You've got to get a hand I in his face. I cannot get the offense going, so we'll see. We'll get it going now, man. I can't, can't do it. Burke takes it to 21. That was a Base great mask. hit. He wasn't getting away from that one. Personal foul. Face mask on the defense. <clears throat> oh, boo first pass. I was definitely facing. I see. I can see the way he was tackled. It was. From their own 46-yard line, first down. Little handoff. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. Jones gains eight yards on that play. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. 
They hand it off. Tackled after a decent run up the gut. A nice first down run there. Yeah, first down, and I'll tell you what, the defense was sold on the pass there. From the 40-yard line, it's first down. He'll get the call again, and he makes it out to about the 37-yard line. Jones gains around three yards on the run. And he took a shot on that play, Brad. It looks like his head might be still ringing a little bit. Second down and six. Ball on the 37. Nice run there. King comes away with five yards on the carry. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Pickens, back to throw. Fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. <coughs> this is kind of a surprising call right here by the coach. This is an obvious punting situation. Scrambling around. Goes oh right. God. Picked off. Here he goes. penalty and they'll have to try to get that yardage back here. From their own 38 yard line. First down. Gives it right side. He fights forward to about the 39. It's second and nine. Ball on the 39. Pratt drops back. They'll make the sack. And it was the defensive lineman that was able to make the play. And the defense came up with some pressure there with a the blitz. The quarterback wasn't able to get rid of it. And the result, of course, is a sack. level at the 26 and that'll get him fired up Boy, just a great series for the defense to force the three and out and get that kind of pressure on the quarterback it's fourth down they come out in a punt formation Burke takes it at the 32 oh. he's to the 40 there's a flag down, and it looks like this one's coming back. Clipping on the receiving team. That one will put the Still offense in a hole, and they'll try to get some of that back on this upcoming play. <laughs> From their own 21-yard line, first down. Pickens, back to throw. Come on! And he's taken down at the 39. You think those defenders smell blood in the water? Look for them to get more and more aggressive because they've got this guy rattled. <laughs> Rose incomplete. They got a hand on it. Did you see how quickly he closed on the ball and broke up that pass? 
That's what you look for in a safety. Runs it, and he stops short of the line of scrimmage. I'd look for this offense to go back to some more straightforward between the tackles running. They want to win this thing in the trenches. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 29. Back to pass, and they got him in a hurry. How about the effort of the defense right there? The combination of his speed and strength that he's shown today really impresses me. He's got such great timing as well coming off the edge. interceptions I've thrown, to have it only 3 nothing is pretty good. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. This is not the type of game you'd expect to see from an experienced quarterback. Well, at this point, taking care of the football has to be their number one priority. If they want to get back in this game, if you can't take care of the ball, you just have no chance. They'll go to work at the 20-yard line, first and 10. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Pickens to the air on first down. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. They're really fortunate that wasn't intercepted. Not a very smart decision by the quarterback. He had no shot at completing it. From their own 20-yard line, it's second down. Looks to pass. And it's knocked away. <coughs> from their own 20-yard line third down there are five wide receivers split out the quarterback in the gun he drops back the 50 go and they bring him down at the 35. It definitely positive. puts him in better field position. Yeah, and I just have a feeling that they're going to punch it into the end zone on this drive. I don't trust myself with the option yet because I haven't run it in so long. So the big game resulting from the play. pass play leaves us with a first and 10. They come out in a goal line set. Jones hits it on the inside. There's a flag on the field, and I think I have a good feeling of what this might be. Uh, That penalty drives them back, and they're shooting themselves in the foot here. Well, if they could just keep their concentration, they'll avoid situations like that. First and long now after the penalty. He's going to try and scramble. No! Heavy pressure, and he throws it to the defense. That's a great tackle the 38-yard line. He tried to force that one in there. Yep, and the safety made him pay for it. Great job of watching the quarterback's eyes and even a better catch. Wow. <coughs> From their own 38-yard line, it's first down. Looking to throw on first down. And they make the stop at the 44. And he couldn't manage to get out of bounds and stop the clock. Well, let's see how that affects them here in this situation. <coughs> Pratt back to throw. Tipped away. Man. Good awareness defensively that time by the linebacker. Not only that, but as you saw, he also made a very athletic move to get to the ball. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Throws out and through his hands. The wide receiver wasn't able to hang on. Well, you chance. talk about a solid hit. This guy is a true enforcer. <laughs> They'll bring him down at the 23-yard line. When he made the decision to return the ball, 
I'm sure he thought there was going to be some room to run, but boy, did it vanish in a hurry. Still, he got something out of it. And they've got all their DBs in there to match up against the five-wide set. Really? And he's going to come up with a sack. It looks like the defensive end that got in there. Yes, it was. He did a wonderful job of fighting off blocks to bring the quarterback down. The Aggies ah. take a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. They find themselves in a hole here after that sack. It's second and long. There's the pass. Broken up. Great range as he's able to break up the pass. I know that the safety makes a good play here, but as a receiver, you got to get in there and play some defense. He's lucky that one wasn't intercepted. They line up at the 12. Third down. Throws incomplete. Broken up. Uh, it wasn't a bad pass at all, <coughs> but just a good heads-up effort to get his fingertips on the ball. I can't get nothing. Fourth down. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Davis, the return man. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Davis fields it at the 42. What a collision. Great first half of action, and we're hoping for more of the same. The score here in Lexington, Kentucky 3, Texas A&M nothing. This does not look like a number nine ranked team, boy. Kentucky will be kicking off, and I hope you're as ready as I am to get the second half underway. It's fielded at the two. At the 30. At the 40. Across midfield. Inside go, the 30. Go! To the 10. Yes! He'll take it all I away for the touchdown. The they picked the right time return. to spring that one. Now you make your opponent oh play from behind, God. putting the pressure back on him. That just happened. And he tacks on the extra point. <coughs> That's what I'm talking about. Texas A&M &M is ready to kick it away. He's to the 10. Oh my God, don't let him do it. He's too. taken down at the 34 so yard line. <laughs> From their own 34 yard line, first down. Apparently, the coach's halftime talk really, really boosted. It looks this like he flinched down there on the line. Or this whole team in general. Dead ball. Dead ball. Let's start on the offense. <coughs> Still first pass. So the penalty will make it first and 15. defense really missed a golden opportunity there. That's what separates a good player from a great player. When you have a chance like that, you need to take advantage of it. From their own 29-yard line, it's second down. Hey. 
Ferguson on the handoff. He takes it right side for a good game. Ferguson picks up about seven yards on the run. From their own 36 yard line, it's third down. <coughs> Complete, brought down, nothing doing. Excellent job here by the defense to sniff that one out before it turned into a first down. That'll make it fourth and six. Fourth down, the punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. <coughs> oh, excellent punt. Heading for the corner, and he's taken down at the 17. Well, that was a great punt, and there was even better coverage on the return. The offense will start at the 17-yard line, first and 10. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. The defense needs to be careful. The safety might have made that play, but if he keeps coming up on the run, he'll be spaced downfield for the pass. Second and 12. Ball on the 15. They got to the quarterback a little late there. Oh, wait. No First pass. Out. Open the passes. Yeah! <clears throat> he was a step too First late, out. and he knows it. To learn not to make those kinds of mistakes. <clears throat> From their own 40-yard line, it's first down. Texas A&M is up by four. Play action here. He's going to scramble. Great concentration. A good play fake that time. Here, the play action was key. It held the linebackers there by the fake by the running back, and the running back did a very nice job of carrying out his fake. From the 45-yard line, first down. They're packed in tight on the line. Takes a handoff inside and stopped immediately. Jones gets three yards on the play. From the 42-yard line, second down. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Now he tries to buy some time, and he is drilled at the 28-yard line. He made a real nice play on that one. I'll tell you what, in today's game, you have to have the ability to run the football. Give the quarterback a lot of credit. He made a great play and really gave his team a boost. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 28. Go. 
They hand it off again. Gains his way to the 13-yard line. That makes it first and 10. First down on the 12, and they can smell the goal line. Nice run, and he's brought down. The misdirection play gets him four yards. That makes it second and six. Second down, eight yards from the end zone. <coughs> and he makes it out to about the eight yard line. The halfback lucky to get anything on that toss play. We're at play number nine of this current drive. It's third down. Oh, and he's going to be sacked for a loss. He was a sitting duck on that play. And believe me, these defensive players love a sitting duck. They'll line it up for the field goal. This will be a 33-yard field goal attempt. Kicks up. And the field goal is good. Texas A&M is ready to kick it away. Davis deep to return. Davis from the three. Oh, man, he took him down hard. The offense will start at the 24, first and 10. He lets it go. And he's finally out of bounds at the 49-yard line. This quarterback doesn't seem to be having any trouble with his own, does he? He recognized the receiver was behind the coverage, and he found him with a perfect strike. That's nice passing for a first down. From the 49-yard line, it's first down. <coughs> Pratt on first down. And he tackles him hard at the 41-yard line. Well, they didn't pick up the first down, but he saw that no one was open, so he made the right decision to tuck it and run. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Tackle made the 39-yard line, and the counter is good enough for the first. Yeah, the offensive line did a good job of selling that play on that one, and the halfback was aware of that first down line and got the conversion. <laughs> 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 
First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 39. Can't wrap him up. They'll get him for a loss. You know, a lot of times, coaches look to linebackers for leadership on defense. And on that tackle, he showed you why that's the case. From the 40-yard line, second down. Yes. Wants to throw, but he's not going to have time. They got it. Loss of six yards. That'll bring up third and long. From the 46-yard line, third down. Pratt back to throw. They'll bring him down at the 43. Not much on that try. They'll face a fourth and long. No one on the defensive side of the ball was fooled that time, Brad. So it's fourth down. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. He punts it away, and it's a great kick. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. <coughs> They'll go to work at the 20. <coughs> Texas A&M is up by a touchdown. Here's the give. He makes his way to about the 32. That's a gain of 12 on the play. First down. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 32. Here's a running play. And they get nice yardage on that run. Jones gets six yards on the play. Why did he stop walking? From their own 38 yard line, second down. Jones will run it again. He gets it out to about the 47-yard line. Just a simple draw play there, but they picked up some big yards. <coughs> well, only a quarter remains, and we've got a tight game with the score. Texas A&M, 10, Kentucky, 3. <coughs> First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 47. Run inside, stop quickly. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. You're not going to be able to get by a sure tackler like this linebacker too often. And we'll no. take a break while the injured player is attended to. My running back. Gotta be kidding me. <coughs> oh, what did I hit? Second and seven. Ball on the 50 yard line. He 
fights forward to about the 49. King picks up a yard on the play. <coughs> Third down, and they need to get it inside the 43. Back to pass. Oh, Looking for his man, God. incomplete. He was a little erratic on that pass, but there's no denying that he can really hum it in there. Are you kidding me? He was wide open. Oh. So it's fourth down. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Smith is back to punt. He'll try to keep this one out of the end zone. They get this one off, and no, it's a beauty. No, no, no. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. For Texas A&M, they've been getting into the backfield quite a bit. You know, right now they're just putting on a clinic. And for the Wildcats, they're not only struggling in the pass protection department, they're struggling to get yards. And I really think all this pressure and all these hits on this quarterback at some point are going to start to take a toll on his own mindset and his confidence in trying to move the ball against his defense. He gets to about the 31-yard line. And the tailback broke that one for a very nice game. Give the offensive line some kudos there. They blocked very well up front to create the holes for this back. We've got a first and 10. Ball on their own 31. They give to the tailback. Has some daylight. And they bring him down at the 39-yard line. Great run by the back there. He could have gone all the way. <coughs> Looking to capitalize on the big run. Now it's first and ten. They'll give it off here. And he's tackled after positive yardage. From the 34-yard line. Second down. <coughs> He's hit and taken down. They gained five yards there. Good recovery here by the corner to react that quickly on the throw and prevent this from becoming even a bigger game. From the 29-yard line, third down. <coughs> the 29. No! The defense is no, there to defend the pass, that. but that we're still unable to stop them from picking up enough no. yards to move the chain. Are you kidding me? Did they have challenges back then? Hold on. Oh, that's ridiculous. Come on. Are you kidding me? He did not get that. Wow. I got screwed on that. <clears throat> From the 29-yard line, first down. Slides down to the ground. The quarterback thought he saw a little bit of running room, but he made a good decision to get down in a hurry. <coughs> Flag came out after the ball was thrown. Let's see what this is. Personal foul. Pumping the passes. Come on. Uh. Man, that was close. It looked like his momentum just carried him to the quarterback. Dude, I kept him out of the end zone the whole game. So here we go. And First and goal, and a field goal won't right cut now. it. tackled at the two-yard line. Ferguson gains around eight yards on the run. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Second down. 
all the big boys are on the field now. As both teams have their big sets out there. There's a flag on the play. Holding on the offense. Holding penalties can really kill momentum. But sometimes, if you don't hold, your quarterback can take a pretty good shot. It's second down, about 12 yards out. He fights forward to about the 10. Ferguson picks up two yards with a carry. That was a great hit by the defender. He just drove the ball carrier right to the ground. So it worked out in my favor. It's third down, and they come up to the line about nine yards away from the end zone. Come on. Stop him. Pratt has completed every pass this drive. Yes. And they got him. They need to run some screens and some quick slants to try to take advantage of this pursuit because this defense is coming after them. They'll call on the field goal unit here. This kick will be about a 35 or 36-yarder. And it sails through the uprights. It might be smart for these guys to kick away from that dangerous return there. And he's tackled at the 32. Time's running short here, so let's see what plays out. I think it's pretty obvious they've got to keep the ball on the ground here. Take as much time off the clock as possible. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Here's a give up the middle, tackle right away. King comes away with two yards on the carry. from their own 34-yard line. Second down. Less than three minutes in the game. <coughs> King will try the right side. King only picks up about a yard there on the toss play. Really just nowhere to go on that play. It's a good job of these guys slowing down that running game. from their own 35-yard line. Third down. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Pickens set to go to the air. No! Oh, my God! And he's taken down at the 39. What is he thinking? The quarterback has got to know at this time in the game, unless his man is wide open, that he should just throw it away. It's these kinds of mistakes that can cost you a game. Just under two minutes in the game. Catches it, and he's punished. Davis picks up six yards with that grab. Just under two to go in the game. Deep pass to the end zone. Penalty marker down in the backfield. Might be a holding call. Personal foul. I'll be the pass. Come on. You gotta be kidding me. This was just an unnecessary hit. He should have been disciplined for a play like that. From the 18 yard line, first down. Here's the option to the right. He gets out to about the 15-yard line. Personal foul. Face mask on the defense. 
Come on! Are you kidding me? First out. First out. Oh my god! You gotta be joking! It's first and goal, and they need a touchdown. A little over a minute in the game. Ferguson hits it on the inside. Now what? This flag came from the umpire, and that means this is probably holding. Holding. Only on the Thank you. Holding penalties can really kill momentum. But sometimes, if you don't hold, your quarterback can take a pretty good shot. Well, this is it. They've got all four downs to get in the end zone. They run left, and he'll lose yardage. This is picture-perfect defense by this corner. Great job of providing run support. Incomplete, and that wasn't the greatest pass in the world. Well, I don't know how anybody can throw a great pass while getting drilled like that. Big third and goal. Can the defense stop them? They're going to go for it on fourth down anyway, so I got two downs to stop. Them. Back to pass. What? Scrambling around. A little laundry out on the field, and we'll find out whose it is. Holding on the offense. Huh. I can't give him another gun. But that's a lot of yards to get two down. I'm going to... Uh, It'll be third down again third after down. that penalty. Yeah, now they have more yards to pick yards up for the first down. Plays. I think it's a little harder... I don't know, maybe I should have given fourth down. Ah, uh, what am I doing? I don't know what I should have done. Third and goal for the lead. <coughs> Under a minute left. Yes, and they get baby, the second. Come on. Kentucky will take their first time out of the half. Oh boy, and that couldn't have come at a better time for this defense. They have to score That'll bring up fourth down. down. Yeah, and a field goal won't cut it either, Brad. This quarterback isn't going anywhere. Why are they in the eye formation? Pratt back to throw. Complete. Oh my God. And they make the stop at the 10 yard line. All right, and they're going to have to give the ball this. back after going for it on fourth and long. Not much you can do there. You got to go for it and give yourselves a chance. <coughs> Talk about cutting this game close, huh? The offense will take over at the 10. First and 10. I, but Under man, a minute left in the game. not easy. It's the tailback. Gains his way to the 19-yard line. The offensive line got a really good push there, allowing the back to pick up nine on the play. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. King will run it again. Gains his way to the 30-yard line. The defense calls a timeout. <coughs> From their own 30-yard line, first down. He'll go down to one knee. It's over, baby. 1-0. In a very, very tough game. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. Takes a knee. And what a return to NCAA football on PlayStation 3 with a W, 10 to 6. And so that's going to do it. Our final score in this one, Texas A&M, 10, Kentucky, 6.
Let's get Kirk Herbstreet's final thoughts on this one. Herbie, what do you got for us? This game turned out to be a lot closer than we expected. Kentucky walks away from this game utterly disappointed because they nearly pulled off one of the biggest upsets in school history. But you know what? I think after the initial hurt wears off, these guys will be proud of the way they played today. And for Burke, his great performance earns him our player of the game. For the Aggies, they start the season out with a win. And for Kentucky, they start out the season on the losing end. Well, that'll do it for another game of NCAA Football 12. For Kirk, Aaron, and all our friends at EA Sports, I'm Brad Nessler saying goodbye. We'll see you next time. <coughs> How about that? That was a crazy game. The only touchdown scored of the entire game was a kickoff return. No offense could really get anything going. The defenses were amazing on both sides. Crazy, crazy game. <coughs> Four interceptions in the first half, and I only had a three nothing. I was only down three nothing, so that was a huge moment. Um, that, that defense helped me win this game for sure, because that offense struggled bad in the beginning. But, man, what a game. What a return to NCAA football. Wow, that was crazy. <laughs> that was absolutely insane. I can't believe I just pulled that off, though. I really can't. Game stats, not too uh, good looking there. But, uh... Yeah, it only starts off. All right. So there's a quarter by quarter. I scored all 10 in the third quarter, and that's all that won me the game right there. That was a very low-scoring fight right there, man. That was a good good defensive game. If you like defensive battles, that was a good game right there to watch. I, I um, That was a very good game to watch. I'm very proud of that game. Well, I'm not really too proud because that was a, I struggled bad in the beginning. Um, I haven't played a college football game in so long. The graphics, the the older games, it was just a, it was definitely different. But uh, it took me a little bit to get used to. I started getting better. I didn't turn over the ball in the second half, so I got better as time went. So that's good. <coughs> so. I'll take it. Can't make the national championship game if you don't, uh, if you don't win. So we're one step closer. Only got 11 more games to go to try to make the national championship game. But we'll, we got a tough schedule ahead of us.
I know we're playing number one Oklahoma at some point. At least we're number one right now. So. If I'm gonna do another game today or not, I might play other games, but it was definitely nice to get this going. That's for sure. So as we advance to week two, week one is in the books here in NCAA Football 2012. As we are closing out this broadcast soon, um, thank you for watching. And we will see you next time here on NCAA Football 2012. And uh, looking forward to hopefully more wins as we might have a top 25 team to face in the next game. So I'm sure that will be a lot tougher than Kentucky was. So I definitely need to get my offense working a lot better. But uh, until then, we'll see you then. So long. We'll see you in a little while for something else. This should be a, should be a good night.